trying to get some clarity on the final play. Was that a straight run or was it a read and you just read the wrong thing? In the yeah. Um, you know, like I said, after the game, and I think Coach Sweeney said it too, uh, it was supposed to be a run. Um, but, you know, just trying to make a play. Um, thought I saw something and, you know, I was wrong. And, um, you know, kind of like what I said after the game. Run call. Um, yeah, I mean, there's, you know, there's a lot of mistakes throughout the whole game. Um, you know, obviously in a game like that, everybody's going to point to the last one. Um, and I'm, you know, I'm pointing to the last one myself. Um, but you got to do a whole, a whole kind of reevaluation of the whole game as a whole. And, um, there's a lot of plays that, you know, we want back and that's definitely one of them. So, um, you know, just kind of. Look back at the whole picture and um, just continue to learn how to grow. And you know, I'm I'm thankful for games like that because you know, I I think that you know I'm I'm gonna have a long career here and um, you know having great conversations with coaches and, and other guys. Um, you know, it's it's just you can go two way with this. You can go two two ways with this. Um, in our ways, we're just can continue to grow and just get better every single week. Um, so. Uh, you know, a lot of things. Um, you know, I think we did a lot of good things on offense. Um, I think we've done a lot of good things on offense every single game this year. Um, you know, second drive of the game. Um, you know, we drove all the way down the field. A lot of plays, a lot of yards. Um, and, you know, 90 yard touchdown drive, finished with Jake. I mean, you know, we're just continually marching down the field, just kind of shooting ourselves in the foot and just handing the ball. Um, so, you know, just got to find ways, find, find another way to win. And, um, you know, I'm just, you know, really proud of our offense, just, uh, and our, our whole team is just, you know, we battle till the end. And, uh, but, you know, we'll be able to bounce back and, um, just continuing to uh, lean on each other and lean on our coaches. Okay, you guys get back at five something in the morning. Did you go to sleep? Did you try to sleep? When did you did you grab the the iPad and, and start watching film? Kind of on your own. Yeah, I got back to my place around like six fifteen. Um, I didn't sleep on the plane or anything. Just kind of got home, went straight to bed, um, and then woke I'm up the afternoon. Sure and sorry. Um, woke up sometime in the afternoon, around one or something, and then uh, you know got up here and got some treatment and and, and came watch some film and um, you know watched it and um, reevaluated and then kind of. Was up here for a couple hours, and then you know went home and just tried to kind of get my mind off of it for a little bit, um, and you know flush it. You know, 24-hour rule. Um, so you know you learn, um, and then you get ready for this week and get ready to go get go get a win. I kind of rewatched it. I see, you know, boy, there's there's an opportunity there. Here, do you see that that? We're still not taking full advantage of, of our opportunities that, you know, we can get so much better. Oh, yeah. Uh, I think we get way better. Um, I get a lot better I mean, just as a team. Uh, we, we still have so much to grow, and that's exciting. We're still a very young football team, and, um, you know, now it's just time to build momentum and just continue to, to get better and just, just learn. Um, we've got a lot of guys who have had a lot of su success in the past. Um, and in their years of playing football, and for the first time, they're, you know, they're not getting as much of that, and it's it's really good for them. Um, it's really good for me to just know what winning truly takes, and um, you know, it's it's gonna be the best thing that's ever happened for us. And we're just gonna we just gotta get back and get gritty and um, get back to work, and like we have all season. Um, but.
protection issues, the more fumbles happen, the more pressure there is, and maybe you guys are, maybe that's having an effect um, and sort of self-perpetuating. Do you see that as well, um, just sort of as this trend continues to go on? Um, I feel like when I'm out there, I'm not, I'm not thinking about it. You know, I, I, don't, I don't really put any pressure on myself um, when it comes to uh, actually, you know, holding the football. Um, you know, obviously you're thinking about it when you're throwing it and you're trying to throw an interception, but that's not what you're really thinking about. You're not telling yourself don't throw an interception. Um, but, you know, on mine, I mean, the guy made a good play. I was transitioning, you know, from, from holding it as a throwing position, transitioning to, to tucking it, and he just kind of got his hand in there. Um, but, you know, he made a good play, and, um, you know, I'm, I don't – I don't. I don't feel any pressure for that. Um, I think you know sometimes it can just because you don't want to be the guy who who loses the football. Um, so you know, I don't know. Yeah. During camp, at, there was a time where you guys were running the ball really well, um, and when you can't run the ball, it sort of affects everything else. So how discouraging is that? Just that y'all have the experience of doing it, and it's not as consistent as as you'd like it to be. Yeah, um, you know, I you know I still think we have two of the best running backs in the country, and I fully believe that um, with everything I have. And um, you know, it, it wasn't our best game running the football, uh, but you know, we'll just continue to to lean on it and trust them. And um, you know, it's not something we're ever going to shy away from. And c just continue to to get better at is uh, is just it's it's all aspects of the game. So. You know, we don't. We're not shying away from it at all, and we're just continuing to lean on it when we can. And um, you know, I trust. I trust our guys up front. Um, you know, I, first thing I would say, honestly, uh, I should have started with this: is just continue to look at our, our receivers. Um, those are guys that I'm just so proud of. Is um, through a lot of negativity starting off the season um, of. of you know, people saying certain things about them. Um, you've just got guys play after play after play making big plays when needed. Um, Bo with, you know, big time catch, uh, you know, to open up the second half. Uh, Adam just finally getting loose. Um, you know, Tyler making some big time third down conversions. Um, Antonio with some big catches. And obviously Jake just, you know, just lit it up. Um, so. You know, just really proud of them, and they're just going to continue to 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 come to work every single day, and just continue to be leaders throughout our program. Um, so, just really proud of them, and uh, just never felt like uh, we stopped believing. Blessedness on that mm. play. What do you think that does for his confidence to do it under the lights? The things that you guys saw, you know, before or during practice. Yeah, uh, I think it's going to be great for him. I mean, anytime you get plays like that, it's going to be awesome for him. And he was about three inches away from breaking that thing. Um, so, you know, just to kind of get to get him loose right there was really fun to see. And um, it's going to be great. I mean, it's going to be really good. And just continue to have guys step up. I mean, I'm just I'm so confident in our receiving room. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm really excited about them. And, uh, you know, feel great about our passing game as a whole. And, um, you know, really, really excited for him. Really proud of him. I have a little bit. I have a little bit. I'm really going to dive in right after this. Kind of a three, three, five. Mostly. Mostly. What makes that kind of defense so hard to play against? Um, I, I'm not. I mean, I'm not completely sure. Um, you know. I don't really have a comment for that, to be honest. Uh, I'll, I'll probably watch more of it today. And, um, you know, I, I was really focused more on the game yesterday. Um, so I've had class this morning, so I'm probably going to go watch some more today. Yeah. Um, I mean, I don't, I don't think anything was really any different. It just kind of plays just got made. Um, you know the the touchdown. The first touchdown was it was an amazing catch, um, a great protection, and um, you know a heck of a play by him. And just kind of had to give him a chance to make it, and he did. And 
Um, and then you had the big one up the middle uh, for like 40, 50 something. And, um, and then, you know, obviously on that same drive, the, the amazing catch that he, that he made in the end zone. Um, so, you know, just a big player, a big player uh, playing big. Um, and, you know, that's what you love to see. Yeah, of course. Um, you know, he's he's a guy that I can trust on and really got to just kind of, you know, throw it to. Um, not that I was, you know, holding off on it earlier on, but, you know, just that I have more confidence in um, for sure. You know, I feel great about it. Thank you.